Bangladesh Legal Aid and Services Trust started its journey in 1994 with the objective of providing legal aid and services to the disadvantaged and marginalized section of the people, particularly the women and the children. The core program of this um, organization is ex uh, giving access to the justice. For that, you know, we practice both informal justice system and the uh, institutionalized justice system. The informal justice system is the mediation. If mediation doesn't work, then we go for litigation. The strength of uh, BLAST is that it has the presence from the lower court to the highest court, Supreme Court of Bangladesh. We have presence across the country. The formal system is time consuming and the cost of uh, litigation, court fees, the fees for the lawyers are uh, quite a bit. The poor people, first of all, they do not have the knowledge about the law. They do not have the knowledge of the rights and they are very afraid of court, formal court system. They feel that it's a very complex system. They don't know. Another thing is that distance of the court from their houses, from their areas. They have to travel a lot. Maybe they have to travel 400 kilometers, 300 kilometers, 200 kilometers. Sometimes they don't have the money to go to the um, court after traveling for one hour, two hours journey. And maybe that they will have to stay one or two days there. So it needs cost money. To give them a relief from this kind of thing, we have resorted to this informal, or we have uh, as an auxiliary to justice, formal justice system, we have uh, encouraged or we have been um, uh, giving them help through this mediation, informal justice system. You know, informal justice system or this mediation, or you can say shalish in Bangla, these are not alien to this part of the uh, world. In uh, 50 years ago, 100 years ago, there has been this traditional system of shalish or mediation in the villages, in the rural areas. And they used to mm, do that. But perhaps there were the uh, you can say the demerits or flaws were that those times maybe those are imposed by elite of the people, on the poor people. The poor, they did not have the voice in the process. But now we have, in our mediation, we have involved the stakeholders, we have involved the beneficiaries, we have involved more women.